On this very floor just about one year ago, Penn State guard DJ Newble hit a shot in overtime to shock the Buckeyes with an upset victory for the Nittany Lions. Well, just about a year later, the Buckeyes made sure the history would not repeat itself as they blew out Penn State by a final score of 75 to 55. You know, we weren't we weren't talking about last year as much as we were talking about uh, this year. You know, it, it, it's, it's a different team, they're a different team. Um, we just wanted to come out and play our best basketball. We knew that was a team that could beat us, uh, as evident by what happened last year. And uh, we just wanted to come out, play ready, or be ready, and uh, continue to play good basketball. While he might have said that last year was a distant memory, Thompson certainly played as if he had retribution for the Nittany Lions on his mind, leading the Buckeyes to victory with a career-high 22 points on the evening. That was was big for us. I was so happy to, to see the ball going in for Sam. I mean, he's, he you know puts a lot of time in, and um, you know we, we've kind of been saying if, if we can get him making some shots, I think it makes us a lot more effective just in terms of, of our spacing and uh, you know creating driving lanes, that sort of thing, and and you know his ability in transition. You know, everybody fears he's running to the rim. Uh, you know, being able to step out and knock down the shot definitely helps open things up for us. As well as Mata, both Thompson and D'Angelo Russell can see the Buckeyes are better when more than a single player can step up offensively, which hasn't been much the case often this season. I mean, teams can't really key on me if, if, if other guys are stepping up and uh, doing what they're, what they're good at, um, just making shots and playmaking. Uh, so, I mean, it makes the game a lot easier for me. Um, we, know, we know what D'Angelo's going to do uh, on any given night. We know what he's capable of doing on any given night. Um, you know, we're just that much better when, when other guys are playing well and uh, when, when I'm playing well. So it's just something that we got to keep doing, it's something that I got to keep doing. Thompson also believes that Ohio State's defense that allowed Penn State to shoot just 32.2% from the field on Wednesday night can also help the offense to find their rhythm. I mean, the whole team really feeds off of our defensive energy. You know, when we can get stops, we can get rebounds and get out in transition. Um, that's when we're at our best. And uh, any time I can, you know, take an opposing team's best player and uh, really try and uh, <clears throat> make it tough for him, really try and take them out of what they want to do, it's just that much easier on the offensive end. Winners of five out of their last six games, the Buckeyes will next head to East Lansing for a Valentine's Day matinee with the Michigan State Spartans. Until then, for Lantern TV, I'm Hayden Grove.